Hello guys, welcome to TechItCrazy.com and uh, welcome to our uh, Take It Crazy YouTube channel. So if you guys like our videos, please subscribe to our channel. Don't forget it. And if you like our videos, like it, comment uh, your opinion and also share uh, this video to other guys. So today I'm going to explain you uh, how your YouTube videos uh, can be visible on your blog page. So whatever YouTube channel videos you are uploading into YouTube, you can directly uh, put it on one page in your blog. So how you will do that? So today I'm going to explain that. So for that one, I'm using uh, your 2 WP plugin. So this one. So if you go to the description of this, so this is like modern responsive video gallery. This will provide uh, easy embedded videos from YouTube playlist, YouTube channel, and video IDs to your WordPress website. So if I go to our channel, Take It Crazy, these are the videos uh, uh, I have uploaded till now. Uh, so I just want to place this uh, entire videos list into one WordPress page and that WordPress page will be available uh, in our blog. So that is Take It Crazy. So how to do that? So first I'm going to the plugin session and I'm adding new plugin. I'm entering uh, this your QWP. Now I'm installing this. It is installing now and I'm activating this. So it is uh, being loading, loaded. Once it is done, you will get the settings option. So I want to display my videos in grid and uh, three columns. Total videos are like 15 per page and pagination type is load more, HD version I'm showing. So these are the default settings that will provide by Yo2WP. And if you want to change any kind of player mode from pop up or large as kind of and also player width size uh, and also like controls, auto play, all those things you can just uh, keep, you can change it if you want. So as of now, I'm going with the default settings. Uh, I will explain the remaining advanced settings maybe in next video. And for this one, you have to mention the YouTube API key. So for this one, uh, this plugin makers uh, provide one guide also. If you go to that guide, those are like simple steps for this. First, you have to log in your Google Developer Console, and then you have to create a project, uh, your 2WP, which they mentioned. And after that, you have to enable YouTube Data API V3. I'm showing that one also. From there, you have to get the api key and you have to paste that that's it now uh, i logged in my uh, google api console page now i'm creating a new project so i'm saying this yo yo to wp i'm just creating this So once I create uh, the <clears throat> your 2WP project, I'm just going there and I'm going to library, clicking on uh, the web search level. So I am activating this YouTube data API version 3. I'm enabling this. So I'm enabling my API. Perfect. So now if i go to my eo2 wp overview and now credential <clears throat> if i go to the credential this is the api key and um, we have to give the restrictions okay you have to set up API restrictions to use. Now, 
go to the connection there are no restrictions and settings for application restrictions and uh, okay restrictions now you click on this youtube and save find that now this api key is ready and i am copying this key and uh, i am going to the wordpress plugin i am just pasting that key and save changes so it is saving the changes so settings uh, are saved now thank you for activation uh, this wp is already done and now if you are going to a new page yes it is uh, creating a new page now here you can see i'm just giving videos my new page uh, youtube wp so i want to just uh, to give my entire youtube channel address to uh, get all the videos at uh, one place so this is my channel and i'm giving my youtube channel and verify perfect take it crazy insert short code now i'm publishing page <clears throat> so it's uh, publishing my page once it is published let us uh, check how it will be perfect page is published now you can view this page <clears throat> so yeah. these are the videos i have if i click on this it is playing like this <clears throat> pop over now i'm closing this uh, once i see perfect i'm just closing this now i want to add this page in my menu now i'm going to my menus my website menus now i'm just adding this videos page to my primary menu videos add menu mm. Mm. put in here auto wordpress save menu so it will take some time mm. while doing save we'll just wait it is saving the menu so it's a very simple uh, so i saved this menu so once we load this uh, website yeah now we have seen this uh, videos as a menu uh, in this event. so when i click on this videos menu so i'll have all the videos which i have in my channel so it is showing in one place so let's say if i have more videos so i will get load more option so when i click on load more uh, the remaining videos will come after this so the by default i have put only 15 if you want to put more than 15 you can give more than 15 value uh, there is it so it's very simple uh, there is no coding to do uh, to add these videos uh, youtube videos in your blog or in your website so it's so simple to maintain maintain is easy user experience is easy i mean it's very friendly user friendly so i uh, have personally experienced this is very good uh, plugin and i have seen the ratings also so very good rating they have given and uh, uh, see uh, out of 68 67 are uh, high rating and uh, one is four rating. and also they are updating uh, uh, i mean they are giving much support uh, to resolve the issues so in the last two months if you see uh, there are six issues but they are they cleared six out of six issues so the customer support is also very good uh, for this uh, plugin so i recommend this plugin for uh, 
the videos to be uploaded on your blog if you really want to go for it so if you like this video like and comment and uh, share this video to your friends uh, uh, and the respective persons who uh, want this uh, kind of plugins for tips and uh, technology related tips and don't forget to subscribe our channel thank you so much